I take it you're all here for the student winner announce. So, so we had, I don't know, about 300 yeah. entries. So if you are a finalist, you know, to get that far is a huge achievement. And what we'd like for the students to do when you enter is go through the whole process, you know, from shooting it to editing it to getting it printed to seeing it. So you have to kind of achieve in all of those stages in order for us to be able to present your work. And whatever the results today, you know, you can always say on your CV that your work is exhibited alongside world-renowned photographers such as Chris Floyd, Tessa Buddy, etc. etc. Um, so we're very collaborative. Uh, and this goes beyond finalists, students, we're an open door, keep in touch. Um, these are tough times, but these are collaborative times. So uh, six months down the road, a year down the road, if you want to reach out, just say you were here and you have our attention. Uh, I'm going to hand over to Carl, who's Senior Commissioner for Channel 4, who's got the results. Hello. Hi. Hi. Thank you. That's all right. And David? Yes, so we'll, we'll bring David in. You can say your name first. So without David, David is Managing Director of Alumno, who are the sponsors of the, uh, the competition, but more importantly, or as important, uh, they allow the whole festival to continue. Uh, so David's going to say a few words. It wouldn't happen without Alumna, without David and Rebecca. Yeah, Rebecca as well. Yeah, so this competition wouldn't have happened in the first place without the funding. Well, well done, everyone. I've been very impressed with the quality of working here. Obviously, some shy and experts and all of this. I'm really pleased that we could go on the journey with you again. It's great to see it in another location as well. And the quality of work and the depth of talent, I think, is quite extraordinary. Um, so for us, it's, it's a great platform for us to sort of engage with our customers, which are students and young people. We want to, to see the talent and us get an opportunity to uh, display their work and have the confidence to display their work. I think it's all about that, those first steps and getting the confidence to be able to put yourself forward. So, just like saying well done to everyone and, and best of luck for the future and we'll great hands with uh, Peter and Sharon in terms of getting that mentorship that I think is crucial to making yourself successful practitioners in, in this field so well done everybody. Thank you. Well I've got the fun bit. Um, so yeah, hi everybody, I'm Carl Palmer, I'm Senior Photography Commissioner at Channel 4 um, and was absolutely honoured this year to be judging alongside the rest of the panel uh, all the student work that came through. As I said, we had over 300 people enter, the short list, well, the long list was a very difficult decision and tough to get down to the six of you that made it here today, so congratulations to all six of you. Um, and the decision on a winner and a runner-up was very tough as well. Um, so five of the judges that are here today, the decision was literally only made this morning. Um, you might have seen a few of us running around trying to grab each other and discuss the work between us. Um, and it was really tight. We kind of put together a scoring system um, and there was two points in it for the you know, kind of between first and second. And a real split decision between the judges. Um, but I think a real testament to the quality of both the pieces of work that have made it to the winner and the runner-up position. And to keep you all waiting a little bit longer, uh, I just want to say uh, how brilliant the other four pieces that aren't necessarily going to be recognised here as a winner or a runner-up, but should be incredibly proud to be displaying here, to be printing, to be part of this, um, and I look forward to following all of your careers. I think I found you all on Instagram, so I'll be following you there for sure. Um, and yeah, hopefully one day, I'm sure we'll be working together, and one of you will probably be my boss at some point. <laughs> um, so without further ado, uh, runner-up first of the, uh, the six awards is uh, Thoughts from Under the Floorboard by Louise Bailey. Aww. I also 
experience. Had my student house burned down when I was really? at university. <laughs> so it really <laughs> ran through to me. Um, <laughs> Yours through more unfortunate circumstances than ours. We set fire to the curtains, so it was our own fault. Um, but no, it really went true, and it was a really beautiful set of images. And I saw you here earlier with your t shirt. So yeah, yeah, I was thinking, I was of thinking it, of it, sticking it up, but I ended up mixed media. Yeah, yeah. Forward, so, um, so no, congratulations. Oh, thank you very well. much. Cheers. Um, and then. Photo North this year is When Sea Becomes Sky by Jasmine Ashley Locke. Congratulations. Well done.